My name is Duncan Spate. I work for Hitachi Consulting and I lead the, the automotive sector in our industrial business unit. Really where I focus is, uh, is working with some of our manufacturing clients uh, in, in two main areas really, um, in the manufacturing process uh, and in the engineering processes. So the challenges I'm seeing in the automotive industry um, are twofold really, depending on whether we're talking to manufacturing or whether we're talking to engineering. Um, in engineering, um, it's complexity. So if you think about a car 10 or 15 years ago compared to a car today, they're completely different. So managing that complexity is, is one of the biggest challenges they have. Um, on the manufacturing side, it's related. So, you know, if you've got a more complex product, how do you make that in a cost effective way? How do you make sure the quality is still there? How do you make sure um, you can predict failures so that you can, you can improve productivity? They're the main areas that people are focusing on at the moment. So, the trends in the automotive industry uh, are more around um, customer experience. So, if you think about uh, cars of today, um, being connected to your car is really important for end users. Um, so connected car initiatives are, are huge for most of the OEMs. Um, things like ADAS, advanced driver assistance systems, where we're trying to connect cars to infrastructure, again, massively important. Um, things like uh, changing the models uh, for buying cars rather than buying cars in the future. People will probably be uh, renting cars or getting a car by by the hour. So those, those, are, those are challenges that the automotive sector have to try and get their heads around, understand, um, and then and change their business accordingly. We're doing some work with a luxury car manufacturer at the moment around their whole digital transformation and, and for them digital transformation means um, transforming the business, so the back, end, the back office processes, so the, the, the typical things that an IT consultancy would be involved in. Um, but more interestingly for, for, for me and I think for, for the industry as a whole is actually how we're doing that um, across engineering and across manufacturing. So they recognise that digital transformation means digitising the processes within their, within their factories um, to, re to really see the, 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 uh, the optimisation that we talked about earlier. Um, and also uh, in, in the engineering domain looking at how they can use new uh, consumer le electronics technologies to support their connected car initiatives. And these all fit within their, their digital transformation programme and we're helping them to try and pull that together and, uh, and deliver that as a, as a package of work. My experience in the automotive sector um, has come from probably 12 to 15 years worth of experience working with manufacturing OEMs um, and tier one suppliers, so helping them to understand how they can transition their business from being a manufacturing organisation, making physical products, to incorporating software. That's, that's really where I spend a lot of time. And the other area is around, um, is around manufacturing and, and plant maintenance activities. So those are the two things I really bring, two expertise areas I have, and, and two areas I'm really passionate about.